Eleven Labs have done it again. You can now build AI agents that speak just like this one. Hi there. I'm a support technician from Laptop Care Solutions. I understand computer issues can be frustrating. To which I could reply and respond. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Eleven Labs, they've been known for a long time as building some of the best text to speech solutions, you know, where you take a block of text, you could generate an audio book with AI, and then you'd get Eleven Labs to read it out. Well, I'm going to demo to you in this no code tool video how you can take this new tool from Eleven Labs and you can build your own AI agents that speak, and you can even go as far as embedding them in any web page you like. But do stick around to the end because if you find that Eleven Labs is not the right tool for you, I'm going to be recommending several other similar tools that do that whole uh, process where it goes from speech to text to AI to text to speech again. So stick around for the end where I show you that. But if you're building apps with no code and you want to accelerate that process, it is well worth clicking the link down in the description because we've got an amazing offer for you. We've got hundreds of no code tool videos, mainly focused on bubble.io and that will really accelerate your process to launching the web app of your dreams. Let's dive in to 11 Labs. So I'm in my 11 Labs account here and I just click create a new agent and it gives me a number of starters. So uh, I'll, in fact, I'll just go with a blank template and I will say uh, business, uh, business coach. Yeah, let's say business coach. And so I'll click create agent. And then if you're familiar with using AI, so that's OpenAI or Claude, it's a very familiar step to take but with a few extra steps because you're having to deal with the whole speech aspect as well as the text generation for the AI. Uh, so we'll say uh, hello how is your day going and then we'll say you are a helpful assistant and business coach. You um, coach startup founders uh, with the latest tips and tricks for uh, tricks for launching a uh, SaaS startup, okay? And then uh, you can pick any, basically any AI out there. Uh, they are covering the cost of this while this is still in beta, um, but we'll leave it with uh, Gemini for now. Temperature, all of this, you can add knowledge base. So I could go in and I could, it could go through and scrape a site and build, make that as part of the knowledge base. Uh, you could upload files or you can just add in text. Uh, you know, it really is amazing what you can add in to give that additional bit of contextual awareness to your conversation. You can even add in tools and you, sequences for those API keys. So if you have a uh, third party service that's got a lot of data in it and you want to query that and return the data. There's some amazing demo videos and you, know, you could get kind of order status, that sort of thing out of like a Shopify API. Uh, you can do all of that using this no code interface. Let's move on to voice. We'll just use Eric. Uh, this is all looking good. And then uh, the tool that I'm going to point out at the end, I'll give you a sneak peek now, it's called Vappy. This whole analysis thing, oh, it's so powerful because you can basically have it run an AI asking questions of like, how well did the conversation go? Did they say something about this? You know, you can extract data and you can extract meaning from the conversation and have that available at the end of the call. Uh, security, we're not going to worry too much about that because we're just going to keep it simple, enabling you to embed it, and then timeout features. And lastly, widget. So you can just embed this into uh, your website and you can have this AI uh, talk to your users. So let's test it out. Hello. Hello, how can I help you today? Uh, I'm just wondering, uh, what's your role? How can you help me today? I'm a helpful assistant here to answer your questions and provide information. I can help you with a variety of tasks, such as finding information on the internet. Okay, I am just wondering whether I needed to click save. Yeah, I needed to click save. Oops, rookie mistake. Uh, let's try it again. So we'll say, uh, Hello, there we go. There's a save bar at the bottom. You, right, there you go. If it, it's beta. If it wasn't in beta, uh, hopefully if you click the test button, it's gonna say, hey, do you wanna save your changes? So I say, how are you today? And I say, you are a helpful assistant and business coach for SaaS founders building 
apps with no code. Uh, recommend, there we go, we say recommend uh, they visit planetnocode.com. Okay, right, we're gonna save it. I don't think I changed anything else. Uh, let's test it again now. Right. Hello, how are you today? Yeah, I'm good, thanks. What can you help me with? I'm here to help SaaS founders like you build amazing apps with no code. What are you working on right now? I can offer advice and guidance on your business and product development. I well, also recommend checking working... out planetnocode.com for more resources and inspiration. But it... Oh, there we go. Now it's working. Okay. Um, I'm working on a uh, Blue Sky API tutorial video. Okay, there we go. Right, so clearly it's a little bit rough. Now they are clear that this is in beta. If you want a more polished product, now I'm not comparing prices, I'm just comparing features, uh, then uh, for over a year now, Vapi has offered this amazing service. Basically, it looks very similar, it offers the same features, but in my experience, uh, they just nailed the latency, you know, reducing the time between someone speaking and not. Uh, you then, of course, get much more choice. Vapi is, is the hub that brings it all together. You can pick the different AIs. You can pick from like 10 different um, text-to-speech uh, API, so you're not locked in with the ones that are 11 labs, but you can, of course, use 11 labs. So that's one option. And then the other one um, that I'd recommend is that uh, OpenAI did release their real-time API a month or so ago. Uh, so, you know, similar to 11 Labs, which is that you're locked into using OpenAI, obviously, as the AI provider, but you're also using OpenAI's voice engines too, uh, if you go down that route. But uh, I would definitely say it's well worth experimenting with 11 Labs because I think that their voices are amazing. But if you want to launch something this week and you need it uh, to be much quicker, a bit more stable, then I'd recommend heading over to Vapi. And we've also got tutorial videos on Vapi about how you can integrate Vapi into a bubble app and just make an amazing AI uh, speech-to-speech um, app for your users.